iPhone 15 Pro Max, I'm gonna show you a bunch of little secrets that you may not have known that I find to be really, really cool. So without further ado, let's jump into this video. Well, the first one is to switch through apps really quickly. So open up an app, and then at the bottom you see your bar here, you can easily and quickly switch between any and all apps that you have open so that you can get to them really, really quickly. I thought that was really cool and very, very important to have when you're trying to multitask. Next up is standby mode. This one is really cool because it shows you information that's relevant and important to you while you're wirelessly charging your device. And I'm gonna show you a wireless charger that's today's sponsor that's gonna be great for that. So let's check this out. And the sponsor of this video, Anchor Mag Go wireless charging station is going to help us with it. It is a compact, small wireless charger for three-in-one devices. So it plugs in via USB-C, lift it up. Your phone connects here. You can either have it vertical or horizontal. You can place a pair of wireless buds right here, like the Apple ones. And then you also have the option at the back here to lift this up and connect a Apple Watch. So you can have your phone, your buds, and your watch all charging at the same time. Now a bunch of cool facts about this. You can charge doubly as fast in a snap with this charger, and it can also charge at the original 7.5 watt as well. So if you have older accessories that need that original charging speed, it can do that. But again, also at 15 watts. Also, it will charge your Apple Watch your Apple Watch Series 9, 47% battery boost in just 30 minutes. And like I mentioned earlier, this is compact, so you can close the whole thing up and you're ready to go. It's really, really small. It's about the same size as a Apple Magic Mouse, as you can see right there. Everything's linked down below, so check out those links. But regardless, this is standby mode and you can see a clock. You can see your photos as well. It'll go through like a photo slideshow. You can swipe over and see your calendar. It, really cool stuff for standby mode. Next up is battery health to check out the battery health of your battery. So go to settings from your home screen and then from there you wanna go into battery. All right, there's battery. Then click on battery health and charging. And then from here, you're going to see some stats about your battery. So you can see the maximum capacity at 100%. But what you can also do is right here, charging optimization. If you go in here, you can set a limit so that the battery will only charge up to 80% every time. That's what it'll max out. And that will prolong your battery life, but it will also short shorten the amount of time you could use your phone because it'll only go up to 80%. So there's a little give and take there, but still pretty cool to prolong the battery if you don't want to have to always replace it every few years. Back into settings and go into general and then go to about. Go all the way down and you're gonna see your manufacturing date and first use and how many times you have charged this battery fully on here. So you can see I have a manufacturing battery date of August 2023. The first time I used it was October 2023 and I've had a cycle count of 14. These are rated um, for hundreds of charges, up to 500 charges and then they potentially might start dying on you. But there you guys go, you can check on the basically the manufacturing and the cycle count of how many times you've charged this battery. Next, open up your camera and go to 1X. And when you tap 1X, you can go through the different lenses. You can see 28 millimeter, 35 millimeter, 24 millimeter, and it just cycles through these and different uh, focal lengths that you can see in here. So pretty cool to be able to you know switch between all the different lenses that you have just by tapping that button right there on your iPhone. 15 Pro and Pro Max. The next one is cool if you like your music to crossfade and you use Apple Music. So what you're gonna do is go into settings. We're gonna go back here and we're gonna go into the main screen of settings and you're gonna look for music. There it is, tap music. And then you're gonna scroll down a little bit more. And the one that we're looking for is crossfade. Turn that on and you can even set the amount of crossfade you have. 
And basically when you play your songs in Apple Music, it'll crossfade into each other. So you sound like a DJ. You know, DJs mix music into each other. This will do a very similar effect. As you probably know, you get those verification codes when you log into your bank or any kind of app that uses a verification code that gets texted to you. Well, you can have those automatically be deleted after you use them. What you wanna do is go into settings. I'm gonna go back to the main screen of settings and we're gonna look for passwords. So go to passwords. And then after you tap that, from there you wanna tap on password options. And then you'll see a button right here, it says clean up automatically. Tap that and it will automatically delete verification codes in messages and mail after inserting with autofill. So you have to use autofill on the keyboard, but other than that, it will automatically delete those from your email and from your text messaging. This last one might be my favorite. And what you're gonna do is hold and press the button over here on the side, the power button. And we're just gonna open up Safari real quick. We're gonna go to a website. Read this to me. What is Google planning for its 2024 flagships? Watch. Next. Google isn't exactly known for keeping its projects tightly under wraps. And we've seen time and again that the company's phones leak in their intact. Google isn't exact. So you see, this is actually pretty cool. It will read on your screen for you. So if you don't want to listen or read, I should say, it will read it to you. So very cool stuff. Thanks for watching guys. Hopefully this video was informative to you. If you want to pick up an iPhone 15 Pro Max, it's linked down below. But also today's sponsored wireless charger, Anchor MagGo wireless charging station. Three in one charger and it charges fast as well at that. Thanks for watching, have a great day and we'll see you down the road.